Good morning, Longhorns, and welcome to RBV TV. We have a great show today. I'm Braylon Hamilton. And I'm Ryan Sanchez. It is Wednesday, October 18th. And remember, here at RBV TV, we don't break the news, we, we put, put it, it together. together. Congratulations to the RBV Marching Band and Color Guard for their sweepstakes trophies and high caption awards in all categories at the Vista Invitational Field Tournament. The Marching Band and Color Guard traveled to Hacienda Heights for the Golden State Field Classic. Good luck and good skills. If you haven't already booked your senior portraits, now is the time. Contact Studio 94 online or by phone to schedule your session. The deadline is early this year and students not photographed by Studio 94 before the deadline will not be pictured in the yearbook. ID photos will not be used. Attention Longhorns, get your No Pity for the Kitty t-shirt before we run out of stock. Limited selection available. Get it now before we run out. We will not be reordering before the big game against Vista on October 27th. Now let's toss it over to Leona with the couple club and career announcements. Thanks guys. RBV's GSA invites you to join our club, a safe inclusive space to have fun and make friends on campus. All are welcome to participate, LGBTQ plus and allies. Meetings are every Tuesday at lunch in room 113. Medical Missions Club meets at lunch every Monday in room 343. The club is collecting items for their hygiene kit project. Items needed are travel size shampoo, soaps, toothpaste and toothbrushes, etc. There are flyers around campus to see further items needed. For more information, see Mrs. Napier in room 343. Items can be dropped off in the same room. Back to you, Braylon and Ryan. Now joining us in the studio for a couple sports announcements is Aiden Orpeza. What's happening, Aiden? Thanks guys, just a couple sport meetings coming up. Girls Soccer Trial Informational Meeting is Thursday, October 19th at lunch in room 235. Boys and Girls Wrestling also have a meeting later today during lunch in the wrestling room. The wrestling room is right by room 343. Just look for the sign above the door that says wrestling. Back to you guys. Thanks, Aiden. That's all we have for today, Longhorns. But before we go, we have a few new teachers here at the ranch, and we're going to tell you a little bit about them in our newest segment, New Faces and New Places. See you next week, Longhorns. Hook, Hook em. Em. school memory oh that's hard my senior prom was really awesome it was at Universal Studios it didn't get any better than that <laughs> but also my ceramics teacher Mr. Burquist I, I learned a ton in his class and that's what inspired my love for, for teaching with play my favorite part about teaching is definitely learning alongside my students I don't know the, all the answers so it's fun having that moment where the students are teaching me and I'm teaching them and vice versa. It's that like moment of discovery together. Um, the adjustment's been fun. I'm coming over from Roosevelt Middle School and um, I love the staff and the students here. I also love what I teach. I'm teaching ceramics and 3D sculpture and it's, um, it's a lot of fun. My first job was working in Disneyland. I worked in what was once Venn Village House. It was a Pinocchio themed restaurant. I think it's Beauty and the Beast. My home was Fantasyland. If I were not a teacher, I would like, I don't know, to, I would like to work for National Geographic, do a little more travel. 